let's make some pumpkin soup. I'm using one butternut squash. Remove the seeds and the membrane. I'm saving one quarter of the squash for another recipe. I'm using four legs too. Bake at 200 degrees C or 400 Fahrenheit for 30 minutes or until fork tender. Set aside to cool down. Return the legs to the oven and continue baking for another 15 minutes or until they look something like this. Don't throw out the scraps. Add them to 700 grams of vegetable stock. The pumpkin seeds as well. Mixy mix. Bring it up to a simmer. Cook for 8 to 10 minutes. Cover and set aside to infuse. Scrape the pumpkin flesh from the skin. Add the skin into the stock to infuse. Remove the flesh from the charred skins. Don't throw out the skins. Add into the stock to infuse. 2 tablespoons of olive oil, 1 yellow onion, season with salt and pepper. Salt it until translucent. Let's take a moment and appreciate how adorable these carrots are. I oblique slice them, add in the carrots and mixy mix. 1 tablespoon of coconut butter and mixy mix. Cover and cook for 3 to 5 minutes or until the carrots are fork tender. 3 cloves of garlic and mixy mix. Half tablespoon of my homemade pumpkin spice, 1 tablespoon of my homemade pumpkin spice syrup and mixy mix. Drain the stock, discard the residue. Add in the stock and deglaze. The roasted leeks, the roasted butternut squash, 100 grams of my homemade kabocha puree and mixy mix. Bring it up to a simmer and cook for 5 to 8 minutes. Transfer into a blender and blitzy blitz until smooth. Transfer back into the pot, season with salt, pepper and mushroom powder. Mixy mix. Add a splash of coconut cream and mixy mix. And now it's done. Onto a serving bowl, some pumpkin seed oil, some more coconut cream, some pumpkin seeds and some parsley. Enjoy! Get the full article at fatto.sg Let's devour this. Super hearty and yummy delicious. Perfect for this season. You really have to give this a try. Let's test some bread and dig in. This is so good. 100% vegan. Thank you for watching. Have fun in the kitchen.